Warning, entering ecological dead zone. Adding report to data bank. I don't know what that means. Oh, peeps! Shields up! What up, peeps? It's your friendly neighborhood Archon Kai here. Hanging out today, playing some more Subnautica. I hope you guys are all having a good day. I'm having a pretty great day, to be perfectly honest. Just uh, doing some stuff. You know, getting down to doing some recording. Finished up some work. If at any time you find yourselves enjoying the video today, please don't forget to show your support and smash the thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel, peeps, don't forget to subscribe as well. We're going to need you in just a minute. That was a strange noise. I didn't know what it was. <laughs> uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe as well. In the last episode, we went out and we explored the Aurora in its entirety. And, you know, I thought there'd be a little bit more to it, to be honest. It took a long time to get through, but I expected to find some more stuff. And I think I might be at a, a standstill point in the game here, peeps. I don't really know what to do next. But I do know that we've gone ahead and we got ourselves a new blueprint. And I thought to myself, well, self, you should probably go ahead and make this prawn suit thing. That, uh, you know, as everybody seems to be talking about. So we need a prawn suit. And then there's also the possibility that we need this Neptune launch platform. But I think we might just hold off on that for a little bit. It seems a little, you know, a little early. So, let's get this prawn suit underway. So let's pin it up here. And then while it's pinned up there, it's going to give us the list of stuff that we need. So... I don't know exactly where all of the things are that we're going to need, but I know it gets deployed out of the mobile vehicle bay. So, let's have a look. First thing we need to do is we need to figure out this aerogel, which is gel sacks and rubies. Uh, we can get that taken care of no problem at all. Next would be under basic materials, probably. Plasteel ingots. We need titanium ingots and lithium. That we can take care of as well. Enameled glass, not a big deal. And then diamonds and lead. I want to see how much of this stuff we can actually make from inside of the base river because I'd, ooh, I'd like to try and use up those resources before we use up anything else. So we need two aerogel, which means we need two gel sacks, which are these fellas right here. Two gel sacks. So one, two, and then if we take our thing and we go like so. Oh, can I get uh, three? Two, three. Very nice. That's actually exactly what I wanted to do. So two gel sacks. And then two rubies. Do we need anything else from out here? It doesn't look like it. All right, so I think we have rubies in here. Let's just come inside and find out. Uh, I believe they'd be right here. I have one ruby, so that means we have to run up to Steve. And do we have a blinky light? There's not a blinky light. So yeah. Um, all right, let's get to it. We need uh, we need some another ruby. Uh, is there a spot I would put rubies? They're probably upstairs in the crafting area. Let's have a peek. Gold, silver, lead, diamonds, and rubies, ladies and gentlemen. Please. One ruby. So that's two rubies and two gel sacks. That's going to make our arrow gel. The next thing we need is titanium ingots, two of them, mm, and then four lithium. So do we have enough? I don't know if we have enough titanium. And then I don't know if we have enough lithium either. Okay, so let's do this. So we need two, how many of these? One per, so I need two titanium ingots. That's 20 titanium. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I happen to have uh, a titanium down in the base. And next it's glass and stalker teeth. And I think I have all the stalker teeth in here, but we're going to go check it out. All right, Steve, we'll be right back. River's probably going to welcome us this time when we come in. Wow, nothing. I just... Uh, no love. No love at all. Uh, okay, titanium should be in this guy right here. That makes two titanium. Next thing we're going to need is lithium. Hmm. Do we have some lithium floating around? Where's some lithium at? Here's some hot diamond action. We're going to need two of those bad boys. And we need two lead. Uh, lead would be here? No, but we need four lithium. I do know that. Lead. Where would the lead be? Stalker teeth, how many do we need? Uh, two stalker teeth. 
with two enamel. Oh no, we only need one enamel glass, so one stalker tooth. I don't think I have any lead. Huh. There's no way. There's no way. We're out of there it is lead. I knew it. I knew it the whole time. I just uh, I wanted to psych you guys out, make you think that there was no possible way that we were going to be able to pull this off. Uh, and then I think the other thing that we need is just glass. So I need a couple of crystal because I need two glass to make one enamel glass. All right, let's get to this. First things first, let's get some glass online. Is it just glass we need? I thought it was enamel glass. It is enamel glass. Okay, glass online. Let's get this out of the way and then we can uh, remove that bad boy so we can remove. Uh, and there we are, enamel glass. We have gone and done the thing. The next thing we need is two titanium ingots. There's one. And a two. He's done it, ladies and gentle peeps. And then we need two plasty ingots, so there's one. And a two. We've gone and done the thing. Okay. I don't want to say that I'm completely amazing all the time, but I gotta tell you guys, like, I've got this on lockdown. Two Aerogel, one. Counting with Archon Kai. Two! Aerogels completed, and that, ladies and gentlemen, peeps, gives us the ability to make the prawn suit. So, in order to get the prawn suit, uh, we're going to need our mobile vehicle bay. I do know that it gets made inside of that bad boy. So let's come up here. Into our gear bin, grab our mobile vehicle bay. We've got some leftovers that we should probably just squirt up here so that way they're in here. So it's got a couple of crystal, there's some diamonds and some lead. Lead right here. Squirt, squirt, and diamond over here. Squirt, squirt. We've gone and done it, and we have everything we need. All right, let's, uh, oh, no, we needed the diamonds and the lead. Duh, dingus, two diamonds, two lead. He's done it. All right, let's go. Uh, emergency view. Wow, that was that was a violent sneeze. Violent sneeze. That's what I've got to say about that. All right, I kind of want to drop this thing, like, right here. So let's do it. Mobile vehicle bay. And let's just go up. You and me, peeps. We're going to do this together, like so up towards the surface. That way it doesn't have so far to float and we don't have to wait for it to get there. And let's just do it right here. Deploy mobile vehicle bay. Ladies and gentlemen, we've done it. Uh, okay, so now what do I need? Laser cutters? Repair tools? Looks like a repair tool right here. And come on up. Let's have a conversation up here. And we have our buddies. Hey, little buddies. All the buddies are here. That's awesome. Mobile vehicle bay. Activate vehicles. Prawn suit. Here we go. It is normal when first piloting a prawn suit to feel a sense of limitless power. Wow. Prawn operators receive weeks of training to counteract this phenomenon. You will have to He's make do with done it. I'm trying to dive. Wow, it drops like a stone. Let's get down there. Wow, check it out, guys. Names uh, suggestions in the down there for the prawn suit. Let's hit, let's give it a go for the first time ever. And Oh yeah, look at us go. Thump thump. Oh wow. Check it out. Can we run? Running is not a thing we can do, but we can Oh yeah, okay. Punch. Punch. We've gone and done the thing. So in order to play with this fella. Oh, he's got some jets. We got some jets. Sweet. In order to play with this fellow, we're going to have to upgrade him a little bit. So, in order to upgrade him a little bit, I think what we're going to have to do... Uh, can we come over here? We're going to have to get Carly out of the way and get our get our new buddy up here. Welcome aboard Cal Systems Online. Thank you, Carly. I appreciate you. Unbelievably, like you would never believe, do I appreciate you because you've made my life so much better for the amount of time that I used you. All right, we're out of here. That's, I hope that's not the last time we ever use Carly because she's awesome and amazing and I love her. Uh, empty storage. Oh yeah, power cells. Oh, baby. All right, here we go. Into the moon pool. Oh, this could be bad. Uh, I'm new to this, so bear with me, guys. And we've done it. 
Welcome aboard, Captain. And River welcomes us aboard as we jump on. Okay, so we have four upgrade slots available. Uh, we should have a look and see what's available in here. Under Prawn Suit, we have the Jump Jet Upgrade. I feel like that's an important thing. But we don't have the Crystalline Sulfur or the Nickel Ore in order to pull it off. Hmm, Torpedo Arm, not so much. Drill Arm, I believe, is important. We have most of the stuff that we need in order to make that. Depth Module MK1, we can't quite make that either. Wow, there's a lot of stuff here that we can't make. But the first thing we can do is we can make that... that uh, that arm. Now, I'm going to come over here and I'm going to grab a quick drink of waters, uh, which should be uh, over here in the... Do we have a fluid? We have a water one right here. Oh, it's a... it's a... do flickers. And more do flickers. We're going to leave them be. Do I have a water? I don't have a water. Let's go get ourselves a couple bladder fish. Uh, like so, and like so. Just a couple of bladders. We'll probably need actually three. Silly Archon. Three bladder fish, and actually, I'd really like to get these peepers out of here. Food is not a, an issue for us, so I don't think peepers are a, a requirement inside here. Bladders are a big deal. Uh, I'd like to have lots and lots and lots of bladder fish. So, like so. Alright, has our food. Our food's actually doing pretty good. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to make up uh, all the water. Two. And a three. And then we're going to cook up a peeper. And now, in our miscellaneous bin, we're going to score the rest of these peepers. Actually, we no, not in the miscellaneous bin. Hang on. We're not putting them in the miscellaneous bin at all. We have a, a bin down here specifically designed to house some food. Like so. And now we can go ahead and drink three water and eat a peeper. And we could probably have one more bladder. Oh, or we could just drink this bladder right here. Disinfected water. Oh, we did that with uh, other stuff. Okay. Now, let's have a look at lithium, pardon me, uh, titanium, and diamond. We do not have enough titanium in order to pull this off. So we're going to have to take a quick trip out here, and maybe, just maybe, you and I, with the assistance of nothing, can come out and find some titanium really fast. Um... A little bit of hot wreckage action would be in order, is what we're really looking for. I'm not seeing any. Maybe a little bit down here? Yeah, there's some hot wreckage action right here. There's one and two. Oh. I mean... It looks like a bad place to be. Creep vine, sea glide fragment, like right here. Uh, there's a couple more titanium right here. So I can't believe of all the things for us to be running shy on, titanium is the one that we're running out of. And we're going to take a trip over to Steve. Because Steve is where we're going to find our diamonds and our lithium. Everything of ours is all in one particular spot, and it's getting kind of... It's worrisome. Welcome aboard, Thank you, Steve. That's awesome, buddy. I appreciate you. Um, yeah, all of our stuff in one spot kind of makes me a bit nervous. Oh, did we screw that up? No, not really bad. Only a little bit. So I needed four diamonds. That's a lot of diamonds, dude. That's a lot of diamonds. And lithium. I need a lithium right here. Can I can I squirt it? Thank you. And a lithium, and we need titanium. So let's do it in here. Actually, we have everything we need. We may as well just go back to river and use river's power instead of Steve's in order to pull this stuff off. And we're back. Okay. All right, let's get to it. So we need titaniums. Give me all the titaniums. And we've done it. So now we can go and we can make that drill arm. Let's go do that. And we could probably make an energy, an engine efficiency module. Hmm. For the Seamoth prawn suit. Yeah, okay, we'll get one of those too. So we're going to make ourselves a drill arm for starters, and we'll get that popped into our prawn suit ASAP. That's, uh... Oh, we've got extra stuff and things, too. Um, that's what the, the, the kids say nowadays is ASAP. So I need a computer chip and polyaniline. Computer chip, polyaniline. Let's go check this out. Alright, what do we need here? I need a computer chip and polyaniline, gold and hydrochloric acid, which means I need to make hydrochloric acid. 
Okay, so this this stuff we can actually make most of this right here. So let's get ourselves and then one, two, three. Three deep shrooms. And a salt, which is in here. Uh, salt, salt, salt over here. Okay, and a salt. That'll make our hydrochloric acid. And then we need a gold, which is probably right here. That's copper. Uh, and a gold. Okay, and that'll make that. And then we're going to need an additional gold. And we will need the copper to make copper wire. And a table coral sample, which we don't have any of. Table coral, table coral, table coral. I, I know where it is. It's I have it in Steve. We're just gonna we're gonna grab it from Steve. I'd like to get that engine efficiency module on the go here. Table core or this is coral tube. Table coral. Two of these bad boys. Alright, let's get to this. Uh, and right back inside. Copper! I need a copper. Can I have a copper? Copper. Copper. One more copper. It's only one. I need I need two copper. Two copper. All right, now we've got everything we need in order to pull this off. Head back into river. And then we're going to take this bad boy out for a run. And see how it goes. All right, here we go. The busy box is real. Okay. Copper wire, computer chip. And now, hydrochloric acid. Polyaniline. He's done it. All right, let's get back over here and we'll get this all crafted up. Engine efficiency module. And there it is, ladies and gentle peeps. That means our batteries will last a bit longer. Our, uh, not batteries, but you know what I mean. All right, let's give it a go. We have to have a look at some of the other upgrade stuff that needs to be uh, acquired here for this bad boy. Where's our... Where's the way in? Right here. Oh, he's, Steve's opening up to receive us. Almost, Steve. I almost made a man. Hang on. I gotta make sure I get this just right. And... Please accept us into our into your thank you. All right, again, guys, names in the down there uh, for the new boy, the prawn suit. Is that your uranite? Your ranonite? Is that what that is? Your ranonite crystal. All right. So now the next thing on the agenda. It's uh, it is the night time. We've got food. We've got water. Uh, I've got all this stuff here. The next thing I want to do is I, powering up. and up we go uh there's a spot over by the island where we saw the sunbeam get blasted out of the sky and i kind of want to go check it out and i gotta figure out where it is hang on because around that island is some very deep stuff and we should probably go check out and look in the deeper areas for some of these extra materials that we're looking for. Oh, there's our, uh... Uh, there's our, uh, mobile, mobile vehicle bay. Alright, let's pop down. And here we go. So I'm gonna head on over to that island, which should be right over here. And I'm gonna check out and see what I can find, peeps. Um, this is our pod of, our native pod of... Reefbacks, which are incredible and amazing. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to head on over to this island. I'm going to check out what's going on. Don't go away. I'll be our bees. There we go. Just a little bump on the tail, Steve. You're okay, buddy. Let's check out this wreck. Buzz Buzz, not yours. A 
being awful quiet. And we're back. Alright, going into the door. Gathered up everything around the outside. Now it's a question of what do we see on the inside. Okay. We cut through this one. We cut through this guy. Let's do this first. We'll go left. Because it's right. And not right. Because it's wrong. It's so bright. Okay. Ooh, what do we have here? No signal. I was hoping that we'd be able to get some of the upgrades from it. Um, hmm. Looks like another another cut door. Alright. Alright, a couple of cutting doors. Alright, here we go. What do we got? PDA action. Cyclops Sonar Upgrade. Very nice. Thank you. And we got what we're in here. Hot Nutrient Block Action. And that's about it. And then an Airway. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to come out. And I saw a Scanny deal, I thought. Perhaps not. Oh, it says close. We don't want to close it. Alright, we're going to come over here. We're going to grab some Hot O2 Action. I'm going to snuff a little bit, pardon me. Thanks, Steve. Glad you've got, you're have you on top of things for us. Alright, let's get through this air duct system. Can I, can I please go through? Thank you. And we don't scan any of that. That's not a way to go, so it's air duct time. Here we go. We have lots and lots of time here, peeps, so we're good. Uh, grappling arm upgrade fragment. This is a big deal. I, I, I want this guy. Uh, one of two. Hopefully we find two of two while we're in here. More nutrient block action. More nutrient block action. Very nice. All right, let's see if we can get through this door really quick. I hope you guys... Listen, I hope you guys had a Merry Christmas. <laughs> That's a... Uh, there we go. Okay, what are we getting here now? Uh, here we are. More hot prawn suit action. Yes. Grappling arm upgrade. Ladies and gentle peeps, he's done it. Incredible. Another one? Yeah, we can we can use the titanium, hot titanium action. Alright, anything else in here real fast that we can use? No signal, no signal. This door is closed. Alright, we're... Oh. More of this hot action. Negative. Alright, we're out of here. A lot of noises going on outside here. I hope there's nothing in here with us. That's all I've got to say about that. Okay. Out. Out. Out for some hot O2. And right back in for that other door. Right here. I know it gets right dark. I just... I, it's cranky. There we are. We're in. All right, what do we got inside here now? Whole lot of nothing. Excellent. So happy we came in here for a whole lot of nothing. Oh, a bag? Empty storage bag. We don't want that. No reason to have an empty storage bag. Sparky Sparks. Unopenable doors. All right, we're out of here. Ladies and gentlemen, peeps, that's uh. That's that. I'm going to put some stuff away and we're going to keep exploring. We're back. And we found the smokers. I don't know what that means, but we found them. I mean, I know what they are. They're, 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 they're smokers. They look like they're smoking. Um, I don't know how much deeper we can go over in this area. I mean, I, it feels like we should be able to get deeper. Maybe we can. Over here, is this... And I heard some weird noises, I'm not gonna lie. And they kind of freaked me out a little bit.
I am prepared though. I have creature decoys. I have silent running. Oh, here we go. Oh yeah. Down the hole we go. Warning, entering ecological dead zone. Adding report to data bank. I don't know what that means. Oh, peeps! Shields up! Oh. Oh. Oh, I don't know what it was, but I'm not happy about it. But I'll tell you what. We're going to find out in the next episode. I want to thank you guys for coming to hang out with me today. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to show your support and smash the thumbs up button. Feel free to share the video around the internet as you see fit. Oh, it's still growling at us. Have a great rest of your day, peeps. GG's.